So hello everybody, this is Psychedelic Eyeball and welcome to this tryout LP video of I Am Alive, which was made by Ubisoft. I, the fact that I'm recording this video is already somewhat of an accomplishment, considering that, well, I had to control delete and halt as well my way through this game back and forth in order for the graphics to even show up, otherwise I had a black screen with music playing and absolutely nothing else. This is already really promising, but we'll give it a chance. We gotta see what this game has to offer, because it tried to prevent us from playing it. So here we go. Yeah, I had to try out the cinematic cutscene just to make sure that everything worked, but yeah. I will reset the absolutely no progress that I've done. And yeah, in normal mode you cannot get the best things in the world. All of these games have absolutely need to do that. Ubisoft presents the Southern Person's Firearm Collection, as well then their play toys, which are from Shanghai. Alright, I just woken up, time to have a look at my camera. So yeah, that's a pretty somber atmosphere we have Fast. here. Fast. I'm not sure the sound is working. Wow, it works. Uh, this is a little awkward for me, but if you found this, then that means... I'm recording a let's play. Anyway, if you could try to deliver this video recorder to my home. That's in Haventon, 27 Arbor Street. It's right in front of the park, and well, um, maybe, just maybe, someone will be there. So wait, we're playing the okay. role of a mailman now? My backpack, climbing harness. My sh my shoe. A couple of batteries. A pistol. I've never even fired a gun before. In fact, do I need to stick my batteries in the gun? I can't believe I'm about to arrive. It's been almost a year now since the event. Since the Spice Girls concert. It took me four hours to fly out east. But the better part of a year to walk home. With any luck? Be back at our apartment in another couple of hours. I saw a lot of damage on the way here, but this looks different. There's more dust than anywhere I've seen. I wonder what it looks like inside the city. It's I gonna know, be fine. It's crazy, but I, I just have this feeling that I'll find you. Julie, without you and Mary, none of this makes any sense. Almost home. See you soon. Alright, time to go to the traffic dump in order to finally get us to our apartment. But yeah, for a game which only took 2GB to download, at least the graphics don't look bad at all. Alright, find my way to my apartment. So, I'm gonna trot slowly but surely. Okay. Okay, so essentially I have a stamina bar and... Not sure why the are those little glitter that you see at the bottom. It looks like traffic. sort of blurry. Oh, I it. But there's plenty of traffic because, yeah, you can see now we're currently creating a traffic jam. And this is how you do things in this part. Okay, so is this water right here? Oh, yeah. We're gonna stare ourselves into the water. Alright, how do I jump into this game? Because. I gotta do something that I always wanted to see. Oh, whoops, no. I don't want to shoot at this inanimate car. Alright. Uh, wait. Why did it suddenly shift the camera this way? Hello, game. Do I have to get in the truck? Or... What are you trying to say to me? Okay, I don't have any kind of bullets. Uh, uh, ah, come on. Where the hell must I go? Alright. Maybe I need to check out the map. Okay, so I need to cross this bridge, and this is pretty much where I'll earn my ticket back to home. Alright, got the picture. Always gotta sully my shoe while walking into water that makes the same sound than on the street. You always gonna need some of those. Okay, press space to jump over the gap. Uh, Ah, okay, so basically you cannot do running jumps into this game, or it's just... 
Oh, okay, so basically... Uh, okay, you have to go all around of these places and... Yeah, hit... Oh. Okay, I thought for one second that it was just gonna say, Okay, while you're climbing all the way here, well... While you're currently raiding this, you're, cur you're currently burning all of your stamina away. Okay, so I hope I'm going to the place where I need to be because otherwise it... It's gonna be bad news because I'm pretty much just about to fall. Ah. Alright, here we go. Yeah, this is the perfect game for me, more so considering that I've always kind of suffered from vertical. <laughs> so... Okay, but is there any kind of penalty if I do... if I rush in? Can I actually fall down or...? Ah, okay, here we go. It's back on the same old climbing down and shimmying all over the place. Well, it's kind of neat, I gotta say. Alright, finally back on the ground. I kind of started to be a little bit crazy all over this sort of place. Okay, so I need to find out another place for me to climb on, or can I simply jump across here? Ah, here we go. I am currently learning my way to go to modern environments. Wait, wasn't... didn't I activate subtitles for the game? Alright, we're back. I went a little option tour and all of this and now I can finally go. So, okay, where do I need to go? Is it here? Nah, it doesn't look as if it's supposed to go. Ah, okay. Do I need to climb this tower? Uh, oh boy. Alright, I hope it's just me who's being retarded, because right now I cannot find my way around this place. Alright, make your way up all the way there. Okay, I, ca I cannot seem to climb. So yeah, I hope that I eventually manage to find my way around here, because otherwise... Ah, there we go. It's time for you to outstretch your muscle, your young man. Okay, so we're just gonna use that whenever it'll be necessary, and I'm pretty sure that will happen quite a lot. But yeah, this time around, I'm pretty much set in order to go to do a great deal of journey, because right now I have all of the things that I need in order to go through everything. But the weird thing is, I tried all of this stuff earlier, and I'm pretty sure that I set up all of my options, so why the hell didn't they save? I don't know if it's because I... Uh, yeah, I really don't know. <laughs> Okay, so thank you for reminding me that. I surely didn't know that. Okay, so where am I going? I hope that I'm going somewhere because right now I'm starting to be running low of out of stamina. Uh, ah, shit. Okay. Okay, here we go. I made it all the way up here. Holy shit. This is like... Okay, so now I have absolutely no mean to actually recuperate or anything. Okay, or... Okay, I think I need to... Okay, so... If the game ends up playing like this... Okay, but essentially this is the kind of game that if there's any kind of trial and error, it's really gonna suck because right now I'm so weak that I'm gonna be unable to do any kind of effort. And now, uh, okay. Uh, no, 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 don't go there! <laughs> Come on! Alright, jump on the cable, here we go, this is a... Uh, uh, here we go, Woo!
Okay, I thought for one second that I was just gonna smash my face by going all the way down here. So yeah, this is the most grueling climbing simulator that there's ever been. Okay, approach... Uh, okay, no, they're not talking about that truck, but... How the hell exactly do you get to that truck? Or are they talking about the school bus? Or f something? Wait, did I somehow screw myself over? Because how the hell did I go there exactly? <laughs> oh my god, I hope that it's just me who's being retarded right now, because... Right now I cannot seem to find my way there. Uh, okay, you have to climb there. Oh, okay. Because they said you had to climb on a truck. Okay, but as far as I know right now, I don't really have any means in order to replenish my stamina except for this can of food and even then I... Uh, oh. But yeah, either way, the games both look neat and really weird at the same time. I really cannot make my mind about it. Alright. So, what's the next step on our journey? Will I be able to... And we can be sure that it'll hold on really, really fine. Okay, so basically what we're gonna have to do right here is just to shimmy along here. And here we go. I am an expert adventurer. Which is provided that I somehow hold up. The fact that you're being handicapped of your maximum stamina is kind of a crappy thing into the... <laughs> Come on, drop down, <laughs> okay. Because now every single little bit of effort just pretty much tires me to no end. And why the hell do I keep pushing this key? In fact, every single action that you do requires stamina. I really hope that it isn't all like this. But yeah, there's really some parts into the graphics that are really, really weird. And Right now, I'm kind of looking to have something a little bit more eventful happening because so far this entire game is just a walking around the decrepit city simulator and that's pretty much all it uh, Oh, okay. I hope this is what I needed to do because otherwise I'm pretty much screwed. Ah, yeah, that's certainly where I need to go. I wonder if the game allows you to just do really in it. Uh, oh. I'm just a little man. A little man which is a little slopey dude. But yeah, the fact that I'm just doing a jump like this almost seems grueling because of the fact that, well, I'm so weak during the meantime. Oh great, are you telling me that there's a sewer level right at the beginning of the game? Oh boy, we better burn through this one. So far, are there any item? Oh. Ah, here we go! I've made it through one part of the game! Some characters are protecting their territory. Okay, so... Okay, so basically, every single person in there just lived to really... Uh, wait, how the hell are you supposed to fight? <laughs> Alright. Oh, wait, you have a life system into this game? Oh, dear, this is gonna be fun. <laughs> Alright, time to have a look back at the options. Okay, now this time I should be able to do something concerning this villain. Wait, I'm pressing the button that is required in order to uh, to actually fight, but yeah, it's just kind of a bad thing that they're not telling me how I'm supposed to fight. Wait, did I really get it? Oh my god, this game is currently being dumb. I don't want any trouble. I'm already gone. All right, I suppose this is. All right, I suppose this is just an avoidance simulator for the time being. Uh, 
Okay. There's a lot of dust down there. Pretty thick. Just like you, my good old buddy, because you cannot surely find a way in order to get a weapon out. Okay, so where the hell am I supposed to go now? Wait, so the guy is complaining that I'm running even though I'm like an entire mile away from him? Wait, do I need to go down here? Apparently not, so... Okay, so apparently my way is through this one guy, but... Why are they not telling me how to attack? That will be really nice to know, game, because right now you're not giving me any kind of help whatsoever. Oh my god. Okay, so now, because I'm all the way there, there's absolutely nothing that I can do, so... I hope that I've missed something. I really hope that I've missed something. Uh, oh my god, I'm dumb. Alright, so we finally figured out what we were supposed to do after using a feature in the game which is called looking around the level. Oh my god, there's gonna be so much editing to be done in this video for sure. But hey, at least we've managed to overcome this ho hobo of doom or whatever he's supposed to be. But the bad thing about this really weird and crazy filter is that Wait, I can't even jump across there. Earlier I jump across bigger gaps than that, and now you're telling me that I that I actually need to walk all over the place. Yeah, right now, I gotta say, the game's kinda neat, but at the same time, I'm really not having a lot of fun playing it. Alright, so let's go over to this part. We're gonna have to find another workabout way of going through this gap. It's starting to be quite the routine. Yeah, this is essentially just looking all over the place in order to do stuff the game. Yeah, it just really seems really random the kind of things that you can interact with the game. Just will be a whole lot nicer if... There was just more interaction in overall instead of simply going on the one part where the developers wanted you to go and absolutely nothing else. Oh, is this where I need to go? Uh, okay. No, it turns out that I have to go where the little red hex says so. But wait, if running burns away your stamina... Uh, Wait, why are there times where they simply bring up my inventory for no reason? Because right now I have absolute. Oh, okay. So basically, you just find those whistles that allow you to simply restart every single place that you go. Yeah, the interaction with the world just feels rather static to me. <laughs> Okay, so this is where. Let's open this gate with something. Huh? Hey, you! I can see you! Hey, hey, wait, wait, no! Step back! Uh, okay. Who? Oh. Please, track. No! I'm not worth a bullet. Uh, no. Come on! No. I'm pressing E, you game! Okay, I had to press E something like five times before E finally decided to kick the guy. Yeah, I really don't know what is up with the weird prompts, because... Honestly, the kind of interaction that you have with all of this sort of thing is kind of neat, but... Oh. Oh, great, so you can... Okay, so you can essentially just lose all of your... Uh... Hey, you. I can see you. Oh. Alright. Alright. Uh, oh, holy shit, there's another guy which is going. Alright. Ah. 
Uh, come on. Just use your mesh hitty thingy. Oh my god. Okay, so basically, I probably should have shot the other dude. Alright. All right, we're finally doing progress into this part. Hey, what happened? But hold on, I'm actually just gonna hide this time around in order to let them go by. Oh. Ah, holy shit, your guy just has to... Ah. Come on, I cannot afford to die here at the young age of 27. Oh my goodness, that was a catastrophe. <laughs> Okay, so this is gonna be my last retry, so if I die once again here, it's pretty much gonna be the end of the road for me. Alright, let's take this... Hey, wait, wait, wait. Okay, so now this... Alright, now this time, I'm just gonna wait until this guy just goes over where I was. Okay, they're just going over. Hey, you. Ah, shit. So, is there any other button that you have to press except the left mouse button in order to finally do something? Or is that pretty much just the only thing that you can do? But Alright, here we go. We finally managed to survive an encounter after countless retries. The combat in this game is not really on the intuitive side. It's pretty much just have you need to think about what you're doing because other than that, you're just not gonna do well. Okay, so I assume that painkiller just allow you to pretty much just reset your... Okay, it resets your stamina ability for a while. Okay, so where do I need to go now that this is finally dealt with? But yeah, I hope that not all encounters are gonna be like this because at this point I'm just gonna regret ever going away with my bullet. Alright, forward to more adventures through the dilapidated wasteland. Wait, is that a propane? Ah, at first. <laughs> How the Why did they ride it this way? It just seems really odd. I picked up the first aid kit, starting with a first. Oh, we're into America land, so essentially it was a United States that perished into the whatever catastrophe happened there. Okay. Who are you? All right. I don't think they're. All right. We're just gonna be a kind Samaritan. Thank you so much. How did you get this? It's just over there. So you haven't been in Hatherton since the event. You know, shortly after it happened. First thing that we had to deal with were the earthquakes. They kept happening day after day. Most people ended up at makeshift emergency centers like the Havington Stadium. And we were protected from collapsing buildings, but there was so much dust in the air, so we had to find another. There was so there. much in the air. And it's been a year now, but we still have aftershocks from time to time. From times to times. So, was it me who did the translation for this game by accident? Ah, okay. I just thought for- Okay, so the lesson that we've learned with all of this is that Earthquakes really make people very violent. Ah, oh, come on, stop complaining about being hurt. I just gave you a first aid kit. You're all fine, you're ready to go. You're gonna have a brand new and exciting life in this... 
This fucking hell hole, holy shit. <laughs> Uh, ah! Come on, just... Oh my god. This is pretty much the biggest thing that I didn't want to happen in my life. To be shot to death by an old lady. So, yeah, this game pretty much is a cocktail of everything. Ah, why am I stuck on a bush? Come on. Oh my god. Okay, so if only there was a way for you to pretty much prep your machete ahead of time. Now that I know that there's there's a whole woman here, I could just prep my weapon and just slice her open. I mean, come on, you just can't see her this way, but no. Instead, look look at how we solve things in the wasteland. You you take out your weapon in front of your opponent and you die from bleeding onto their face. So yeah, this is how I am alive hen. You be you get shot by an old lady after overcoming tugs as well as earthquakes and finally jumping over ravines and climbing over a 100 feet tall bridge. Yeah, all in all, I definitely am not impressed. Maybe I'll try again on the easier difficulty setting to see if it, it is more playable, but it just seems really frustrating. So yeah, that was my Let's Try video for I Am Alive, and well, I hope to see you again. Goodbye.